Hi, today I will be reading you the story called Fish for Dinner. Clive's mother was asking him to go to the shop. Take this money, she said, and buy something for dinner. I don't have anything for your father to eat. What must I buy? asked Clive. A little fish, some rice, and a bun, she said. Now, don't forget, your father likes fish, and do not stop to play. It is getting late. Clive walked down the street. I must not forget, a little fish, some rice, and a bun. He had not gone far when he saw Bill. Bill was kicking a ball. Hello, Clive, he called out. Come and play ball, man. I have to go to the shop, said Clive. I can't stop. Stop a little, said Bill. You can go to the shop after. It was a nice new ball, and Clive wanted to play. So he stopped and kicked the ball for a little. It was a good ball. After a time, he said, I have to go. See you later, Bill. As he walked down the street, he said, a little fish, some rice, and a bun. Just before he got to the shop, he met John. John had some marbles. He called to Clive. Come and play marbles with me, man. I am going to the shop, said Clive. I can't stop. But the marbles were pretty. They were blue and green and red. Clive wanted to play for a little. He would not stop for a long time. So he played marbles with John. Then he said, I have to go, man. He went down the street and into the shop. Hello, Clive. What can I sell you today? Asked the man in the shop. My mother wants, said Clive, and he could not think of what to say. Oh, I know, he said. She wants some rice and a bun. Is that all? Asked the man. Yes, said Clive. He was not sure, but he could not think of anything more. He went home quickly. Here are the things, mother, he said. Thank you, she said. But then she looked at the things. What is this? Where is the fish? What am I going to do? Your father will be hungry when he comes home. And today is the day when he has fish for dinner. I am sorry I forgot the fish, said Clive. I will go back for it. It is too far, she said. You will take too long. Soon Clive's father came in. I am hungry, he said. I worked hard today. I am going to have a good dinner. Today is the day we have fish. Is it ready? I am sorry, said Clive's mother. We only have rice and a bun. What? No fish? We only have rice and a bun, said his father. Well, said his mother, Clive went to the shop for it, but he did not bring it back. He took so long that he forgot. Clive, where is that boy? yelled his father. When I catch you, we will talk about this. But Clive was not around. He did not think his father would just talk to him about it. His father would know that he stopped to play. Clive was sure his father would beat him, so he stayed outside. His father would forget about it by the next day. Clive came in when his father had gone to bed. His father was asleep, so he could not beat him. His father did not get any fish, but Clive did not get any dinner, and he was hungry. Clive did not think he would forget the fish next time. Well, I hope you liked that story. So if you did, please remember to click the thumbs up button below. And if you have not yet done so, please remember to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.